At the third stroke, it will be 9, 26, and 40 seconds. Fifty seconds. Come along with me. The night is open up its eyes to see. Would you like a drone then? What? Drone, man. Stick up the chalk. Make it into a car, eh? Go for a wheel here then. Yeah! We'll best up those corners out though. some water in a rag, love. You can wash this lot off before you do it else. Yes, sir. Fine. Right. Well, we've got a deal then, eh? Right. Thanks. Well, that's that then. What's what? That was old Arthur on the phone, end of the month. Oh, aye. Now it's just a matter of getting organised. Is that all? Oh, with Arthur Selling, all his trade would come here. It'll double our turnover. Double the work, you mean? Well, I only got word again to get some cheap labour, didn't I? There's many a true word. I can just see the card in the window. Bereaved ex-copper seeks strong, sturdy wife. I knew you would love it. Hey, come on, girl, give us a card. We need some more lads, that's for sure. Yeah, old Arthur must have lads of his own. What about them? Well, he's got two. He's very cagey about them. Mm -hmm. I got the feeling he wasn't exactly recommending them. Yeah, perhaps that's another reason why he's selling up. Yeah, it could be. You got the tape there? Mm -hmm. Oh, hello, Mrs. Robinson. How are you? Oh, fine, you thank you. Oh, please. Yes. Any paper? Thank you. Yes, yes, please. please. That's uh, 49 55 please. Cool. Mm -hmm. So, 
Well, I was getting the chop then. You ever have any lip? Arthur Turner's giving up his shop bars. We're teaming up. Hey, over there, come on. And we're going to take over the paper side of the business. Hey. Mm -hmm. Is there any of your mates fancy a job? I suppose it's cool, should I? Yep. Hey, round card. Mm. <laughs> About time you made up a fresh one, isn't it? Mm -hmm. All right, I'll do it, Oh, yes, and what if you don't turn in tonight? Oh, well, look, you can do it tomorrow after your round. Here in the shop on Sunday, all right? Are you listening to me, you? Yes. Hey, round card. It's in the bag, Mrs. Crawford. Well, give us it then. All right, thanks. Oi, where's the fire? One of the flicks last night. Didn't do my homework. Well, wait a minute more. Come back. Are you too busy on Saturday? Why? Well, I thought you might like to pick up a couple of bob. Well, it's okay, Steve. What? You too, Ian. What's that? You can always use a bit extra, can't you? What's well, the job? Thanks, Ian. Follow me. Yeah, yeah. Bring it then before school then. Aye. Oh, yeah. Same as before school then. Aye. Just seen that? Right. That means he doesn't want us. Told you so, man. Big Turner. He'll have stirred it up for us. <laughs> and Crawford. He would have listened. Crawford. What a pig. Bit of a clean up down here. Slimey. Well, it's not as bad as it looks. <coughs> look, we need the space for storage. Hey, look! It's a pipe. If I fix it up, can I use it? Work hard on Saturday and your mum's willing. Fix it up and ignore you, is it? Yeah, right? Yeah, okay. okay. Now, until we get these new rounds sorted, and if you want to do double, at least we get some extra lads. Not me. Mm, it depends. I would. Thanks, Ian. Um, we've had a complaint. Oh, yeah? Mm -hmm. Gog again. Not using gates, tramping through hedges. I said he'd have a word. Now, what lad will use a gate if there's a quicker way? I still said he'd have a word. Oh, yeah? Mm -hmm. Breakfast. Oh. oh, watch it for us, man. You'll be in the mud, Jimmy. Oh, I big much couldn't do without me. Look at the sturdiness, man. <laughs> yeah, look at the shoes. Sturdiness? God. Yeah. Come on, you. Back oh. inside and lend a hand. I don't pay you for reading papers, you know. All right, how are you, God? Stop filling with that thing and give us those boxes. We have training. That's way of losing weight. Burn it off. Burn a hand. Aye. How are you, Gog? But I never dare speak to him. Best centre forward we've ever had. Uh, Dave rangs him at all. Wants to turn professional, didn't he? Yeah, his mama let him. Mm -hmm. All right, Baz, on your way. Right. Hey, wait a minute. He shouldn't be here. He should be resting for the match. The selectors for the school boys international might be there. Well, so might you be if you get a move on. Go on, shift it. Got a lot of rubbish you have again. So oh, I haven't a bit of a clear out. Can you manage the rest? Aye. You fit? No to bother about the morning, man. Going to be a walkover. They're yeah, not a bad team, you know. What's going on then? Ah, expansion, improvement, and more problems. More money, you know. You know, when I've served me time, I'll make twice what Dad does. I suppose for now, the few Bobby gives us for helping out Sundays comes in handy. Ah, yeah, I bet. He's looking for more lads now. Aye. What about you? Me. Well, why not? I haven't got the time, man. Mom's dead setting his good to university. Surely just let us play football. Working's different. Now that I'm in the yard full time, Dad'll need somebody a bit older to keep the kids in order. Green, my Lord, my Lord. I'll never 
Schlange geht der Herr. In Well, girl, what do you think of it? Better. Oh. Is that all? <laughs> I worked hard. All right, much better. Ah, uh, uh, you wake up. Cut a whitewash, new shells, you are not a place. Yes, no. Oh, hello. Oh, yeah. oh, I'm sorry, shall I go with you one? Oh, no, you're right. They're going to win, JG? I'm going to hammer them. Hey, there's more than just him in the team, you know. No, I've been nibbling, miss the others. Well, <laughs> I'm not tickled. Oh, that's 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 not tickled. All right, I'll go. But I've got to be quick. Kick-off's at 10.30 and I don't want to miss it. No, of course not, Pep. Now, listen, uh, old Mr. Turner's backing up now and I said you'd get round there as soon as you finished your rounds for me, all right? Yes. All right, Pat, let's go. Well, hey, let's go. Come on. Come on. Oh, oh, no. Do no more Sunday papers for his lot. Yeah, serves old man Turner right, doesn't it? Yeah, look, see you doing, going to the shop. Flat leg. Yeah, shut up. Those papers will get me for him. Oh, wait. Yeah, boss, I'll miss the kickoff. Being sealed on the ground. Who's fogging them? Keith Sneath, isn't it? Hope so. He's one of old Arthur's lads. Aye. What they hadn't turned up. Oh, never mind. No.
I don't know what you're like, you know. You two coming? Oh, yeah, thanks, thanks for sure. Sure. Oh, I'll see you, dude. Oh, Wonder what happened to pass? Well, there have been about a dozen complaints so far. No papers at all? Mm -hmm. Just half a dozen at the start of the round. Baz, run away from you. Mm -hmm. Food smells good, ma'am. Oh, hello, dear. I'm going around to see young Baz. Mm -hmm. oh, Jenny will fill you in. Or something? Hey, well, Baz never delivered Arthur's papers this morning. Get away. No. And he ran away when I shouted for him and all. Oh, Mum? Uh-huh. <clears throat> Can you slow down dinner a bit? I never thought. I've got a theory. I just want to pop back to the clubhouse for a minute and check it out. What about me dinner? Congratulations to you. You should have gone straight, Baz. I know that now. It's still not too late. I don't know. Not your fault if someone makes your papers. I shouldn't have left them there. Anyway. Anyway, what? They might have thought I flogged them. Oh, men. Oh, Dre for you. You did the one thing that made them think you were in the wrong, twit. Hand it over, Snaith. Were you on the boat? The money you got for the papers you nicked. What? Who are you? Hand it over, you get a good thumping. Yeah, oh! Be steady, be steady. Huh? Those papers were flogging. Bit of private enterprise, wasn't it? They pinched them. Oh, he looked at them. Is that right, eh? True, mate. The polis will. Nearly for them, Jerry. His pockets will be full of loose change. Let's check it out, lads. Get off! All right! Get off! Too scared to tell us. You managed to make him up another bag. Hey, well, best we could do, anyway. There you are. This is cool, but I'm sorry. It's all right, Bert. Uh, Sam, give him a hand, would you? We've had enough complaints for one day. Okay. Well, I hope your dinner isn't spoiled. Hey, well, Davy isn't back yet. Now, where is he? Well, we were talking about the missing papers, and he said he'd got a theory, and he just dashed off. Where to, did he say? Um, boys' club, I think. What about me dinner? Oh, well, then, get it on. Get it on, then, lads. Got the lot, then? Aye, aye. Oh, smash them, lads. I'll show you. Thanks, Bill. 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 Thanks,
Maybe there's more to it than I thought. Yeah, it's not every day you run into the Geordie Mafia. How are you, buddy, lad? <laughs> I'll see an old man about it. Fair enough. Hey, Crawford. Want to protect them for? It's all my fault. Rubbish. Davy had no business rushing off like some daft vigilante. I'll tell him when he gets back. So don't keep him in the hospital. You got the money back, didn't you? Do you really think a few pounds are worth all this? Well, no one will print papers again, hurry. Ah, bet. That's them. That's them. They're back. Oh God! Who's his? Davy. Are you all right? Eight stitches and lucky of that. Has he told you who did it? What's the point, Mum? Let them sweat on it, Davy. Then we'll sort them out ourselves, eh? Any sorting out of it, done, son, I'll do it, understand? You, bed. Go on, I'll bring out a cup of tea. See them? Come on. All right, lads, on your way. Tea time now. Right now, JG uh, starting tomorrow, if we can get up around by then. Oh, yeah. Uh, tomorrow? JG can follow oh, Baz, eh? You get the feel of it? Oh. 7.30. Mr. Crawford. Sam. Well, what about me for a paper round? Just. You? Uh, don't talk so. Who ever heard of paper lasses? <laughs> they got a point, Sam. Those bags weigh heavy. What if somebody nicked your paper? Being a boy didn't have no more chance. She's just she can't get rid of them. Sam, McCann does ask yeah. for paper round lads. That's sexual discrimination. Hey, that's hey, stop. Hey, I wouldn't change it. All right, then. See you in the morning, right? Oh, you're <laughs> not. Next week in the paper, lads, there's drama in the dark. What time is it? It's a bit early, isn't it? Aye, well, there didn't seem to be anybody around. Now, remember, you the wire, me the window, and you the guard. Over then, let's go. That's him, I'm sure. So what's he doing here? Come on, let's find out. The paper lads reading about themselves the next morning. And you can see that next week at the same time. <laughs>